Okay, welcome here today to Outdoorsman Style. Yeah, buddy, we've got so much to show y'all here today. Literally, we are planting Texas sage. Now, Texas sage is a really incredible plant. I'm gonna let Dad, let me turn this camera around. How's it going, Dad? How? Tell us more about this Texas sage that we're planting right here. And there's the plant, by the way. Well, that's the first time I planted any of these here, but it's... Uh... It should be about uh, something to be a flowering plant. It should uh, withstand temperatures and get down to the areas built for this uh, area here, like in Texas or Georgia or Florida or anywhere like that. And uh, at any rate, uh, it can do six. It can do six feet high and it can do six feet around, fully grown if you don't keep it trimmed. But me, I keep them trimmed. Yeah. Also, he's rocking out with the real tree camouflage hat. Look at that. Yep. Real Tree. We support Real Tree and Mossy Oak products. Okay, so as you can see along up through here, we pulled up all the old bushes. We used to have old bushes up through here. We replanted. Uh, we we put new plants of a, a Encore azaleas here that are pink, uh, right here. Now this is a Texas sage. This is a Texas sage. All right, so I'm gonna start digging right here. Let's get into this, guys. And uh, yeah, buddy. All right, so I'm gonna sit the camera right here all right so i'm going to turn this around where it faces me okay there we go all right can y'all see me dig nice let's get into this um actually i'll probably post this right there you have it right here where, where you see it where the uh, uh, oh right here i see this where do I have that thing? Right in here? Is that where I have it? Oh, there it is, yeah. Yeah. May need to... There we go. That's it. I think that'll be about perfect right there, and that'll give us room to see what she does as she gets a little bigger, and then uh, we can trim her to the side if we want it to stay. I'm gonna border this thing out with some flowers up here. This one looks really good. This one looks very nice. Home sweet home. Well, it's like everything else around here, boy. It's been raining a lot. We just got a lot of wet clay. Yeah, it's been raining a lot. That's for sure. All right, I got things I can amend that with and dry it right out. Okay. You can see I'm getting it dug out. It looks really good right in here. Dig out just a little more over here. Okay. All right, let me pick up the camera. Woo! That builds the muscle. All right, let's look around. There's the dug hole right there. Dad's got the plant, the Texas sage plant. Another one over there. Which one do you think is the better of the two? I personally think that's probably the best one. Okay. Oh yeah, that's gonna look really good. Actually, Dad, I think this other one's better. Yeah. What do you think? All right, let me show y'all this one. This is one Texas Sage. We're trying to figure out which one's the best one to put there. There's one, 
And then over here is two. Let's see. Yeah, this looks more fuller. Okay. I thought it didn't, but it does. By the way, look at the blooms on, this is known as the Autumn Twist Encore Azaleas. It's got a dark bloom up here and a light bloom up here. Pretty cool. That was back where it came from. He's planting the plant in there. Look how good this island looks, guys. Looks very beautiful. Now he's measuring it out, making sure it looks good. Now there's a couple things that we use to mend the soil. And let me show you what those are. We use this evergreen soil conditioner right here. And move this bag. And also the evergreen topsoil. So it's important to put a conditioner and topsoil in your plants uh, to mend the soil. Yeah, because if you got red clay like us here in Georgia, you know what we're dealing with. And of course, here's some awesome Miracle Grow garden soil. So, yeah, looks very beautiful. He's actually putting the mended soil on there. We're going to mend this soil right here just enough 